This review was sponsored for my former YouTube MCN, Freedom, who gave me the game free of charge under the guise that I would make this video. In no way does this hamper my review or opinion of the game, and in no way was I paid or enticed to make specific statements about the game except that which offers needed information within the game such as the platform it is available on or various details about the game. Below is an affiliate link which will give me a small kickback if you use it for purchasing the game on G2A. You may also look up the game directly on the PC video game marketplace called Steam should you wish to buy the game directly. In short and sweet terms, Bridge Constructor Portal is a game based around the portal lore and characters. While not as knee slapping as some of the portal games and scenes, it seems to be a decent game nonetheless. I would recommend it to anyone who likes strategy games and would like to spend a few minutes on each puzzle each day. That said, it isn't perfect and it doesn't hold your hand. Based off the indie game Bridge Constructor and sponsored by Valve, BC Portal is at home on the Steam Marketplace. The story is that of a potential recruit working in the engineering division of Aperture Science. If you successfully pass the introduction exam, you will be given a hard hat and set off to build bridges. While the first chapter serves mostly just as a tutorial, I see the entire game not as an extended canon, but rather an optional side quest. Is it good? Not necessarily. Is it bad? I wouldn't say that either. It's somewhere in the middle. While the game offers a few giggles and a few hours of enjoyment, I wouldn't pay full price for it. While I understand that it is officially licensed, I would prefer to see the game around $5.99 rather than its $9.99 asking price. Further, I would love to see this game come to Android and iOS, as the game would be right at home on my phone or tablet. Although this is not the case at this moment, and it is not available on Android or iOS at this moment. It is just something I personally would like to see. So I suppose the final question would be, should you buy it? Personally, if you have the money or if it goes on sale, I would wholeheartedly recommend it. It has a few giggle moments, a nice opening easter egg, great music, and a decent premise. If you like Portal and want a quick game that you can play over and over and you can easily expand with Steam community levels, then this is the game for you. So with all of that out of the way, I have to ask, will you be picking up the game? If so, tell me what you think about it down in the comments below. As always, thank you all for watching, and I do hope to catch you all in the next video. Don't forget to wear your space seatbelts, and please do not forget that this video was sponsored because I got the game for free.